Yeah, I mean, you know, this is about trust. We're asking people for their vote. And, and by doing that, we're asking them to trust us and, and, and put that, place that trust in us. And if they're kind enough to do it, we need to make sure that we honor that. Do you believe that Marco Rubio is untrustworthy? Well, I'd like the people to say. Governor, that he, he may likely talk afterwards about Roe v. Wade. He has argued in his uh, press release that you do not directly oppose overturning Roe v. Wade. Can you speak to that? He's right. I don't. I don't. I'm pro-life, and I believe that we ought to, instead of change laws, change hearts. That's what I said when I ran for governor. I still believe it. You know, I'm not going to change my stripes here. Um, you know, I think that uh, Charlie Crist is a candidate who's a common sense conservative and appreciates that there are different views on all issues, but I am pro-life, I'm pro-gun, I'm pro-family, and I'm anti-tax. And I always have been. And I think that's abundantly clear. That's what people want, somebody who will just tell them the truth. Governor Chris, can you comment on Debbie Wasserman Schultz's comments regarding the RPOF? Well, I didn't see what she said exactly. Uh, she kind of demeaning towards the RPOF and Marco Rubio. Do you want to give a comment about that? No, she speaks pretty well for herself, why I the, think. Why Governor, the new feisty seen... tone? Why the new feisty tone, though? It's an election year. <laughs> Thanks a lot, guys. Thank you, Governor. Nice, not to answer the question.